Can you just type in what is a goddamn Newton, please? Don't write goddamn. What is a it Newton? Will f- screw it up. Is that something to do with Massachusetts? What does it got to do with? Massachusetts? The product was named after the city of Newton. Oh, okay. Stupid asshole. <laughs> you stupid asshole. Who God, knew God. that there was a Newton, Massachusetts? Yeah. Who knew that? City there you of go. There you go. All right, there you go. So there, you that's what my that. Well, Keebler's from Philly. That's what my thing's... I don't give a shit where he's from. You, you think an asshole's never come out of Philadelphia? <laughs> Please. Oh, wait a second. Go back to that. Look at that. The Kennedy Biscuit Company and the New York Biscuit Company merged to form the Bisco, after which the fig rolls were trademarked as Fig Newtons. Okay, I'll tell you nothing. I don't think it's a cookie. Number two, number one. Number it's two, a cookie, Sal. Dude, you when you bite into that, you it, it is an acquired a fig Newton is an acquired taste. Nobody's liking chunks well, of process. What does that have to do with it not with it not being a cookie? What are you talking it's about? A, it's a cake product it's with a fruit. It's a cookie. It's a it's cakey a product with fruit. Okay. Is fig Newtons a cookie? Great to eat, but cookie or cake, fig Newtons won't tell you. Oh, they won't even tell yeah. you themselves. But yeah. you sitting on my couch here today yeah. on all on the day of all Lord, here's the thing. May uh, March here's 20th, the thing. you know. Here's the thing. It's an amazing product that remains mysterious. Your product is so dumb and made for dumb shits. They had to put elves on the package so to get people to buy it. So did you just double back on what you said, and you said it's a goddamn I'm cookie, t- and then you I'm, said it's, it's, it remains mysterious? I'm double back on the whole argument. Ready for this? Yeah. I don't give a shit what it is. It's better than what yours is. Yeah. How about that? A Fig Newton is for people with dentures. That's what a Fig Newton is for. Where are you getting this That's from? That's what it is. When I was little, they were for old people. Nobody touched a Fig Newton. It tasted You're like lying. prunes and God, figs, and it was lying. disgusting. It's, it's, it's like a Pop-Tart. It's no, the it's same not. Consistency he is a pop tart. And I'll tell you another yes, thing. Is. Google the nutrition facts because you're gonna be wow. Oh yeah, I'm sure your you're chocolate. Gonna be wild. I'm sure your all chocolate cookie is better for I'm you. Tell you right, Google go Google go nutrition ahead. facts no, of Fig Newton. Go ahead. A Fig Newton. I think, I'm sure they're only using the finest chocolate. I think, I think at the two, factory I, where they print the, the fudge stripes. Fucking moron. I think I think a Fig Newton has like a, two Fig Newtons like 150 calories. I'm not kidding. All right, let's see. This is for you, Joe, here, quick. This is a, thanks to the abundance of figs in each bar, which is known to be one of the highest plant sources of both calcium and fiber. Abundance. Each serving is also full of copper, manganese, magnesium, potassium, calcium, vitamin K, and antioxidants. There's even protein in them. You lose. You lose. You, you were reading the thing for the organic nature's way fig I read Newton. what I read, and I'm yeah. going to apply it to my cookies. <laughs> yeah. Cal- let, let's Calories in one Fig Newton. 55, all right. 55 calories in one fig dune. Okay. Calories in one fudge stripe. That's not one, though. 70. That's yes, a, it is. No, it's not one. Yes, it is. Oh. 140. There you go, fat ass. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think that's right. That's right. What do you mean you don't think that's right? I don't think that's right. That's right. I don't think it's right. Why is it not right? Go to the go to a, a, a reputable source. Um. Oh, my God. You're just such... It's just such... I love that the internet's never right when it applies to you. It's that's so crazy. It just doesn't sound right. Pimp, I got... Right. Here's, here's how to solve it. Go to the goddamn Keebler website. No, all right, I, I see it. Oh, I okay, see there it. you go, right? right? There you go. 140 calories. Bro. Two cookies. <laughs> let's just do just as just, let's just talk taste. Let's talk taste. I'll talk taste to you. When all I'm day. eating a cookie, I want chocolate. I want butter. I, I don't want care gram. what you want. Okay. I don't want. <laughs> I don't want. I don't want a mushy fig. It's not mushy. It's a wonderful, soft experience with a great fruit filling. Nah, it's figs, for people with incontinence. Figs in the right in the right situation. Figs are amazing. They're, they're an amazing flavor. In the I'll right situation? I, yeah. I'm <laughs> what serious. does that mean? I wouldn't eat figs out of a bag. I'm not into it. But I'll tell you what. I make I make a cheese and, and, and super sot platter. I got a little fig spread on there. Are you crazy? It's it's unbelievable. I like dude. it there. It takes it I to like the next there. level, dude. Did you know about the Newton Thins? Now, I will tell you something. The Newton Fruit Thins are one of my favorite cookies. You, but you those, son of a <laughs> bitch. You... Joe, you want? Why are you being? Why are you being such a terrible person right now? What do you mean? That is not. It's not a fig Newton whatsoever. It doesn't have fig in it. They're Newtons. Fi, Newtons fruit thins. It's complete. That's a blueberry on the end there. Which that flavor, over there is a cherry. Which it's a flavor cookie. do you get when you get it? Uh, blueberry, one hundred percent cherry. As a matter of fact, I thought these were discontinued. Because they came out of nowhere. They came into my life out of nowhere about being, seven, eight years ago, th- and I was raving about them. They shot to the oh, top look, of my list. A better version of your cookie. Dark fudge. Banana. That's banana. 
No, it's banana and dark fudge. As I said, it's a better version of your cookie. That, that, that has nothing to do with your argument at all. I okay. just said there's a better version New, of your cookie. Newton fruit oh, are your little elves pumping out Newtons? Because New, they're not. Newton fruit thins. Newton fruit thins have nothing to do with fig Newtons. It's a completely different cookie line. Completely made a different way. It's a hard biscuit cookie circular that is made from graham, and they put fruit into it that is dried. It's not the same exact thing. There's little fruit bits in it. It's not a fig Newton. A fig Newton looks like a fig sandwich, a little fig sandwich. Let me tell you why else the Newton is better. You can't eat a fudge stripe cookie without disgusting hands afterwards. You can't do it. The entire bottom is a melting fudge uh, coating. How long are you holding these things in your hand? Well, what, you fucking tell them a like you, story? If I'm like you, I walk around shuffling them in my hand for a while before I eat them. <laughs> That's if not I'm like cookie. you. So, but my point is, is Fig Newton's not messy. They're all It's not compact. messy. It's, it's cakey. As soon as you bite into it, it comes, comes bite everywhere. into it. Yeah. The, it's going the, in my the mouth. The fudge will have a snap. Oh, oh wait, wait. I, you, I forgot. You yeah. just one throat them. Yep. Taste buds. They come into the mic. Talking about the food they hate. Talking about the food they like. Two fools gonna fight, but only one food can be right. Taste buds. Man, yeah, they come into the mic. I'm talking taste buds.